Good morning, George TSA. My name is Preston Crawford, and I'm your second vice president. Today, I'm presenting to you your fourth state officer question and answer video. All right, first question. Why don't the Georgia TSA state officers refer to themselves as the League of Extra Nor as the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen? Well, uh, to be honest, when I saw the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen, I had no idea what it was. Sorry, but um, I researched it and found that it was a movie uh, that was released in 2003 and it had Sean Connery in it. Um, so I don't really know, but I do know that the name was already taken. I'm very sorry. That's why we don't call ourselves the League of Extra Gentlemen. But I guess you should watch the movie. I don't know, I've never seen it. I can't, I guess I can't recommend it if I haven't seen it. All right, next question. Um, what has been my favorite moment from this past year? Um, that is a very open-ended question. Um, one great part was all of the guys I get to work with. I mean, Tyler, Austin, Swapnil, Jalen, Trevor, Connor. They're all great. Every single one of them. We've bonded. We're like brothers now. It's, it's really incredible. Um, we really work together as a team, too, which is really good. So we get a lot done when we work. And, um... That's for the associate association, which is good. So, um, take it off. so um, we 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 do stuff for you guys, and that's probably the one of the best things is knowing that when we work, what we do helps you guys, which is awesome. Um, Another great moment was when I was elected into office last March, which was one of the one of the best days ever because that was the day that it all started, and I've loved it ever since, and I never get back what I had to do to get here. All right, next question. All right, what do I think has been the best TSA event so far? That is a very complex question just like the other one. Um, I've been in TSA for three years and my favorite event personally has been career prep on the middle school level of course. I just love how it's gonna prep wink, wink, prep me for um, the future and how I'm gonna have to be able to build a resume and a job application and what? are a resume and a job application the same thing? Yeah, a job application and interviews and, you know, being able to tell what you've done and do it professionally. And I really love how it does that. Um, it also kind of makes you research basic information on different STEM jobs that you could have. And that also really interests me because um, I have the dream of kind of becoming an engineer, which I think would be awesome. Um, but this year there's a new event called Promotional Marketing, and I think that's going to be really fun too. I'm kind of working with that. It's teaching me a lot of stuff I need to know, and I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, next question. Um, what did it feel like when I ran for set office last year? Wow. Um, I don't really remember those couple of days, but... Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Um, it was it was awesome. It was exciting. It was fun. It was, uh, rushes of adrenaline every time. I mean, going up on stage and speaking in front of 3,600 people back then was something that I had never done. But that helped me become the speaker I am today and the leader I am today. And so um, that that experience helped me to get where I am now. And I'm really glad I did it. And uh, it also made me feel um, tired. Uh, it is very tiring campaigning all day and then working all night, working on your speech, saying it over and over. But um, I mean, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta do what you gotta do. So um, it was all worth it, though. It, everything I've done has been worth it to get to where I am now. All right, next question: How am I planning to make 
this next state leadership conference more interactive at the middle school level? Well, um, if you didn't know, uh, the second vice president is um, big on middle school. Uh, I'm actually in middle school. I'm an eighth grader. Also, if you didn't know, I go to Hayhire Middle School in Hayhire, Georgia. Um, I plan on, um, this past year I, I've met a bunch of new people that uh, I'm glad to call my friends now. And we communicated, we've still, we still communicate now to this day. And um, I plan to keep doing that and talking to people and just figuring out what they think that we should do to improve the organization. Another thing to make it more interactive on the middle school level is um, I just want, uh, communication is key. That's, that's going to be a big part, is just to get out and involve them. <clears throat> Alright, next question. What is it like being an 8th grader on a team of high schoolers? Like I said earlier, I am an 8th grader at Hayhire Middle School. Um, and in the, I'm the only 8th grader on the team, obviously. So, that's different. It is different because our school hours are different. Um, you know, they get out earlier than I do, unfortunately. But that that's not as big as the fact that besides, you know, time and stuff, they don't treat me any differently. I'm just like one of them. We're all equal, which is really awesome. And uh, every guy on that team I've connected with personally. Uh, Swapno, Austin, Tyler, Trevor, Jalen, Connor, every single one of them. Uh, we've connected and um, I know them really well. Um, proud to be on a team with them, definitely. So, uh, grade doesn't really matter. Not with us, which is good. They, they all do things for me and I appreciate it a lot, so thanks guys. Um, next question. What is my favorite hobbies outside of TSA? That's good. You do know that TSA is number one. But um, some of my hobbies, I like to be outside a lot. I like to throw the frisbee. I like to kick the soccer ball. I like to play basketball. Basketball season is almost over, but I did play basketball. I played center. That was really fun. I like exercise and stuff. And then there's another thing called ripstick. Here. I have one. And I'm sure some of you know what it is, but if you don't, then it's kind of like an inverted skateboard. Uh, I customized mine blue in the front, that uh, blue in the front, red in the back. Um, yeah, so that's really fun. That's how I like to spend most of my time you know, hobby-wise, outside of TSA. Um, how do I like the Georgia TSA YouTube page? The YouTube page was an idea we thought of at the beginning of the year. And we thought, okay, we'll do uh, our first video. Meet your 2015-2016 Georgia TSA State Officers. Alright, that was good. And now we have 300 plus, I believe. Yes, that's correct. 324 reviews. Um, we never expected it to go that far, but we're glad. Um, really excited about the way that took off and how we have Connor to help us with the videos. Connor's really good with video tech, if you don't know. But he's really good with that, and we're really glad he's on the team, and we're glad we can do fun stuff like that to communicate with you and to connect with you. That's the big reason we do our YouTube videos, is to show you guys kind of an inside look on George TSA, the state officers at least. Another one of my hobbies is playing with my dog. This is my dog, Wags. Say hi, Wags. He's cute. Yeah, we rescued him from, uh, he's got a big long scar down his back, you won't be able to see it, but yeah, we think that he was in some dog fights, which is kind of unfortunate, but we got him now, so it's all good. We kind of look alike. Alright, anyway, oh. Alright, another question. Do I have a personal favorite YouTuber? Yes, Miranda Sings is definitely my favorite YouTuber. Uh, she's really funny. She she does crazy things, and then I also love her true identity, uh, Colleen Evans, and her husband Joshua David Evans. They're both really funny. They um they do shows, and I've been to 
of their shows, which was awesome. Yeah, but I want to know about you guys. Do you guys have a favorite YouTuber? Um, maybe yours is Maria Sings. Maybe your favorite YouTuber just became me. That would be an honor. But no. Uh, leave that in the comments. Put your favorite YouTuber in the comments. Alright. Thank you guys for watching my video. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. And be ready for the next videos. And make sure to watch everyone else's videos. And uh, yeah, see you guys at State.